Hello everyone, welcome to Building the Ultimate Bench Boxcar Collection. My name's Tyrone, and for your viewing pleasure, for your titillation, we have this huge box. It's uh, from Matchbox Premier Collection from the late 90s. 50th anniversary rig from the Toys R Us Collectione on offer. Limited edition set of four Toys R Us diecast vehicles. There is the oh so familiar Toys R Us logo, top and centre. Toys R Us was in Australia for a while. Um, they decided to up sticks and leave town. Uh, I don't even think they're in the States, but I know they're in Canada. Um, one of my regular viewers and commenters, Steve from Ottawa in Canada, tells me Toys R Us survives happily to this day, all the way up there, as we go up there. Should we take a look? I thought the backboard was missing, but that is actually the colour of the backboard in there. We'll get to that. This was 1999, back in the day. Probably in 99, was it? Uh, or 98. So, yeah, 1999. Wow, Prince should be here. Let's take a look. It's got a Mustang, it's got a Ferrari, and a Corvette. And a really nicely done rig. Won't be throwing that over my shoulder. Yeah, I thought that was just playing cardboard at the back, but now. Finally, put that up here. Sweet. Try not to make too much noise. I don't know quite why we went upstairs. Now we're downstairs. We'll start off randomly with the Ferrari F50. There's the cardboard box with the logo forever. How sad. Here she goes. Lovely yellow. Heaps of detail on the interior. See if I can catch you a glimpse through the reflection. It's got rubber tyres, treaded tyres, plastic base. Um, weirdly, I have one from Mainline just like it. Uh, much less detail on the interior, but metal base. It's very heavy. So they go very well together. Nice. So that's the Ferrari F50. Um, should we go with Corvette or Mustang? Let's go for Mustang. So I don't have too many a bit buddies to trot out today. Same sort of box to carry the theme. This is the Cobra Jet. C Jet on the license plate, that looks cool. I think this is the best shape Mustang ever produced. That fast back look. Love it. Looks like it's about to take off. Plenty of grip on those tyres. Here is a main line with Cobra Jet on the bonnet. 428 side decals, decals, whatever you want to call them. Gaudy plastic base and plastic tyres. But it is what you would expect from main line. And the 97 Corvette Coupe. In quite a sedate colour. Grey. Oh, the uh, badge tempo is nice. Happily, the license, oh, the license, the um, headlights are hidden on this one. You see what they did with the headlights on the Ferrari. They don't look so good. 
Okay, Corvette's happily got them hidden. And see if we can see inside there. Some nice touches. Six speed on the license plate. Those wheels match the car, don't they? Hmm. And that came out in the Coca Cola series. And many others came out in 2000 with the chase piece. Pop them there and a lovely green one. It's a premier collection. Same sort of boxes, that one, they're all Corvettes. My table isn't big enough to show all the Corvettes, so we'll just stick with the 97. Nice colour on this one, but um, imagine if they had have done that colour. You always want what they don't want what they don't give you. It's just human nature, I suppose. And uh, metal base, wow. Again, might have been the same year they brought that one out actually. So heavy. Just can't beat metal on metal. And it's a chase piece too. Hmm. The things you learn when you go through your own collection after having left it for a while. And I suppose the star of the show is the big rig. Um, gingerly get this out. There's its box. Toys R Us, 50 years forever fun. It's sad when things um, pack up and leave town, like these guys did, um, in Perth anyway. And the States apparently, maybe they're in your city in the States. Let me know in the comments if Toys R Us is still a thing where you are. But talk about go to town on this rig. We'll get this trailer off. Here we go. Take a look at the trailer first, shall we? Does it open? Oh, look at that. Even the, uh, the locking bars for the container are all done. Wondering if that opens. It should do. It wants to, but not that much. Here you go. Obviously nothing in there. Should be full of uh, matchbox cars, shouldn't it? Tiny, tiny matchbox cars. Yeah, rubber tyres. It's really well done. All the lights. Look at that. Check out the truck. Wouldn't last long as a toy, I think. The uh, aerials and the mirrors would be long gone, wouldn't they? On day one, probably. Nice big chrome exhaust stacks tucked behind those flares. It's a good looking rig. Ford Aeromax. Shiny, shiny base. Very impressive. Yeah, it's nice. And shuffle some of these out of our way. Put him up the back for the end shot. A little bit of matchbox history with the Toys R Us partnership back in 1999. Nice. Uh, like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.